Rocket League content sucks. I was searching searching for new up I don't want to say upcoming, but you know newer channels that I might find good content and I could you know give them some support and stuff. And all I found was just terrible videos, like terrible. So today I'm gonna kind of talk about why I think Rocket League content is really bad. Now, first of all, I need to say that I love this game. Rocket League is one of my favorite games of all time, and I even have more time played than my all-time favorite game. The number one problem that I have with Rocket League content is that it all feels the same. It all feels like every single person is trying to do the exact same thing, but, you know, since it's their gameplay, it's different. It's not really. You're still not being that creative, not that interesting, not that entertaining to watch. Like, I, I think that if you are want to have good content on YouTube, you have to either be really good at the game or have a really good personality. But yeah, I think every video is the same. It starts out with an intro, then it cuts, or it doesn't even cut sometimes, it just goes to really terrible diamond gameplay or plat gameplay. They just end it and say thanks, uh, subscribe, like, all that stuff. But like, realistically, you're not gonna pull anyone in with that. Now, if that's really what you like to do, then by all means, be my guest. I don't really care. Uh, I just want you to know that you're probably not gonna get anywhere if you don't have a good skill or good personality. Uh, another issue that I have is that I feel as if videos feel rushed like i it's kind of like a, a branch of they they feel the same all of them are the same it, they feel like people just put the content out they don't actually take time to make it good uh make it entertaining uh, as if they really did they wouldn't just do what they do they'd be better edited ed, ed, edited more unique and creative uh, but it's just not uh and my my last issue with rock league is that the thumbnails and titles are super boring uh, I, this is honestly one of the things that makes it so hard to find good creators is because you're just looking through and it's waves on waves of the same title repeated over and over. It's one of three things. It's either something to do with a Rocket League grind or just someone playing Rocket League or just the name of the game, Rocket League, with YouTube generated thumbnails and it's so hard to figure out, hey, I may like that guy's personality, but I don't want to click on the video because the video just looks boring already. I don't know how long that little rant is going to be well, when I edit all the stutters out of it, but I can say that I think that was rather short. There's a reason for that. I can't really, I can't bash the the type of content that goes out because there's really not that much to do with Rocket League. Like I can't sit here and say, you know, it's so annoying that everybody does the same thing when they could be doing this and this and this and this and this. When in reality, uh, Rocket League is just such a simple and repetitive game that it kind of makes it hard to make content where I think if they added some more things, like if they added more customizations for private matches or whatnot, I think that'd be cool. But at, at base value that Rock League is currently at, I don't really think it can get much farther. Um, so I don't really blame the creators, although I do a little bit because they could try a little bit harder and actually put some heart into it. So if, if I do, I'm, I'm recording this before I've edited it. Obviously, I don't have any um, clips or screenshots of titles and channels and whatever uh, i will put their link in the description just so i'm giving proper credit to who's in the video i've been bashing rocket league for the past i don't even know how long it's been seven minutes for me but i don't know how long it's been after it's all edited but uh i just i wanted to list a couple of people that i think really are doing well in the youtube community of rocket league one of those people is john sandman uh, just because i think he has a really good personality and he, he really just kind of connects with a lot of people and a lot of people want to hang with him while he's whatever he's doing whether he's just playing competitive which he really does anymore which i honestly don't mind because he's not the best his gameplay isn't that entertaining it's his is his personality uh two other people that i really like when they're paired is uh, rizzo and sizz i do think that they make good quality content um separately when they're just recording that by themselves but i definitely think that they're the best when they're together and they're bouncing off each other and it's just it's hilarious 
uh, because of their personalities and then also the fact that they're both professional players does really help the gameplay part of it. Two other people that I did want to mention just because they were probably my favorite, they probably still are my favorite Rocket League content creators even though they don't really do that anymore is a uh, Turtle and Neat Mike. They tried to make all their videos unique, they were well edited, they were funny, uh, they weren't just the same thing and I really appreciated that because it does get boring eventually just watching gameplay. All the pros like Squishy Muffins and Jazer and anyone else, they're they're also not, not the worst. I definitely don't enjoy them as much um, just because their content is solely based on the fact that they're really good, which I mean, I understand that appeals to some people who want to just learn about the game and learn to get better, and I, I respect that. Uh, I just don't personally like them a whole lot. Another thing, all this video is just my opinion. I completely forgot to say that, but this is all just my opinion, so if you have a different opinion than mine, feel free to think that. But yeah, just to kind of wrap everything up, I do think that Rocket League at the moment can't really be the best content out there, but I kind of just wanted to put this out so people could kind of be aware of what they're doing isn't really going to get them anywhere. And it's really kind of discouraging to look at and know that this game that I love so much has such terrible content being put out. Um, so I think if we just up the quality of our content, make it more interesting, make it more entertaining uh, at a base level, then I think I think it can get to its maximum potential. Uh, unfortunately, I don't I don't think that's very high, uh, unless I don't know, unless something happens, unless they change the game somehow. So again, I'll put everybody that I mentioned in this video, either anybody that I took a screenshot of, or, or I used clips from, or whatever or I mentioned like everybody that I mentioned earlier that was good uh, all their links will be in the description